Alright, there we go. Um, hey guys, uh, I've been, I've, I'm, uh, I like art and stuff. I do lots of drawing. So today I, I, I got a new pen that's, uh, for good for detailing and stuff like that, and just for general handwriting mostly. And I want to try to start getting into calligraphy. So you must even get this into a fountain pen. Um, so these tips. Yeah, they're just split in between the middle of it. Um, this one is a manuscript. They have some pretty good stuff from what I've heard from a lot of other people on YouTube. So, I thought I'd try one, give one a try, and it looks really neat. Uh, I've seen lots of fountain pens and movies and stuff, so I thought, uh, why not try one out? Well, this one uses ink cartridges, and this kit I bought came with a converter, so if you have an inkwell, which I do, is when I went on a field trip last two two years ago, two years ago, I got, no, last year, last year, last year I bought a, um, quill and ink kit, and it had a packet of ink, you put in little, like, handmade glass bottle, and then you mix it with water, warm water, and it has a cork on top of stuff in it, so, it also came with, I don't know other stuff, it came with a converter, uh, it replaces ink cartridges. You can buy like tons of ink cartridges for like five dollars. Pretty cheap. Um, I just went through washing this so it's really watery in the pen right now. Um, but what you do is you take this and you put it down the ink. I think you just put it in like this and you just suck it up. Like that. Kind of like a plunger. And then you just kind of scoop it out. I don't know if that's going to be so Okay. And for what I use, this if I keep this in there, and I want to start writing soon, so what I do is I uncap it, I put it in this little BB jar, across the BB jar I have that I emptied out for all my babies a while ago. Um, I just keep all my tape in there. And for Christmas, I got a ton of calligraphy guns. They're markers, they're calligraphy markers, and they're really cool. They're a whole bunch of different sizes and colors. I got this one's a five millimeter black. This one's two millimeter yellow or er, red. This one, all right. This one's 3.5 millimeter black chisel tip. This one is 2 millimeter chisel tip. Uh, blue is 2 millimeter chisel tip. And this one is 5 millimeter black chisel tip. And I have a 2 millimeter chi black chisel tip as well, but it's downstairs in my bag. Let's keep those in this little bottle as well. Okay, Okay, I have a, a giant art box in this box too. Um, so basically, this is a very nice pen. To disassemble it, you just take the cap off, but it comes already off. And I prefer to take it off and grasp my thumb over it like so. And twisting. That seems to work the best. And then you remove the barrel, which is the end. And then you can also, it comes with two inch cartridges. One saved for later, which I have, which is conveniently stored in the back. Make sure the tip is facing away from the other one. Alright, so you can drop that in. Uh, little ring. I'm not sure what the ring's for. I think it's just a spacer. Um, and this one is, I don't want to take this out because weak ink. So once you put it in, it pops. It's kind of like a CO2 cartridge. So, uh, three minutes already. Cheap. Then you pop this out by just pulling it and it comes out fairly easily. It won't fall out on you. It won't fall out. So yeah, this is very good time for beginners. Uh, a lot of nice ones out there, but for me, this is really, really cool. It's awesome. Now, I'm going back here, you just put the ring on. If you want me to do a full taking a part of this, uh, leave me a comment or something. I'll take I'll take a part. That she needs to be washed. Like, I've been writing a little lot today. I'm like halfway out of ink. I'm not that much. I bought it. Get out of the package. I signed for it because I had a Visa gift card, so I had to sign for it. So I asked if I could take it out, and they said, Yeah, fine, whatever. So it was just some lady who didn't care about her job, didn't want to work, and she's like, And she threw the pen down in the shopping bag, so he doesn't want to She's like, Click, 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 get out. And I was like, Whatever, deal. Got a Visa gift card. Excuse me. Anyways, I'm going to show you uh, 
what this looks like when you write. Okay, right, there we go. Basically, you would hold the flat end straight. Don't shut off on my computer. You hold the flat end straight, kind of like I am right now. No, I, I I don't really do much calligraphy. I just do cursive, and the way it looks is just pretty cool. So um, so uh, let's do hello. Wow, it actually isn't that watery. Terrible at my age. Just ignore the age. Uh. Let's see. Hello. My. Name. Is. Tim. Hello, my name is Tim. Um, mine probably just looks terrible. Yeah, mine looks terrible. But, um, it's a very cool pen. Um, my favorite letter is probably the, G, the C. Um, so, for, to do a calligraphy C, first you would make, um, like, kind of like a triangle stop. So, you'd go, so if you're a righty, you'd go down one. If you're a righty, this is for a capital C. For, if you're a righty, you go, First, you hold it flat, tip flat, like up here, and you draw over down, and come back up, and then you go straight down, and it kind of makes it smaller, end, smaller on one end. Then you'd make a straight line down from that end, and end it with like a kind of a 45 degree angle off to the side, and then you put a line through it, kind of like an F almost. Then you just draw like a regular C around the outside. Okay, and yeah. Mine is the best, but I, I've done better with my regular markers. Just has, it's kind of like that. Now, if you want, you can just add like a little flare in there, here and there. Yeah, you see a lot of do that. Like on YouTube, if you watch any of the clear videos, stuff like that. Now, personally, that is my favorite letter in calligraphy. Um, I've also just kind of made up my own kind of calligraphy off of it. I've just gone and uh, made up a few of my own letters and stuff like that. But I just, they're just real simple to draw. Um, I was just thinking like that. Now, what I did with my markers on the back side, I did a. Uh, oh God, sorry. Uh, with one of my big fat markers, I, I really love that. As soon as I get really, really good at this, to the point where I'm just like outstanding in my handwriting, I might try selling like pictures and stuff on eBay, like their own little frames and stuff for decorators or whatever. I, I don't know. Just a way to make money. I, I, that probably won't work at all, but you know, whatever. We'll see what happens. Uh, I'll post an update on that if I ever. Thing of doing that. I'll check what the prices are going for on calligraphy artwork pieces um, after this video. So, uh, yeah, let me show you this. Um, show you what I was drawing in earlier. Just practicing my calligraphy off a bit. So, I was just trying to test the pen out and get it working, and it wasn't working very good. So, I was just trying to get it to work. And, uh, Trying to learn them from the book I have. So I just I down below right here I started my lowercase letters. That was all the capitals. One line to be a uh, part of the book, and then the next one will be practice book practice. Um, and down here I uh, started doing the, uh, the lowercase alphabet. Uh, so I really enjoy doing these art videos. Uh, I think I might start doing these more often and updates on what I'm drawing. I don't know if I say, yeah, it's all plastic pen, has a metal tip, uh, there's not much to it. So it's just really a pen. Always before you get use one, clean it out. Like, if you haven't used it in a while and you used it last and there's like ink in it or something, then like, uh, what do you call it? 
wash it, just take the tip out, wash it off, then take the paper towel and something and wipe the black uh, flow regulator off, which is the black piece inside the metal piece. And it'll kind of wrap everything up against it. Just kind of wipe that off and then it'll be better. Stop shutting off me. Like that. A very nice pencil. Here's the cap. The pen, I'm sorry. Here's the cap. And then Yeah. Sorry if I made this really long, which I did, and I just terribly screwed up on this. But I don't post it anyway. Have a good one, guys, and uh, keep watching. Please comment, or subscribe. If you want to aim one of these uh, art videos, uh, go ahead and uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I'd really like to make more. I think I might anyway, but if you want to see more faster, then go ahead and leave me a comment or something. Bye.